Uh, she's sweating out of free will. She feels it as her moment. She's smelling blood. Just one more. One more prey to take down, and that's it. Tonight, she leaves here with the diamond. She leaves here with the championship. Same goes for Katie Harvey. This is the last round of this tournament. But I couldn't say the same, the exact same that I said for Alpha Female. Because she's not hunting down a prey. She is gonna try and hunt down a predator. Alpha Female might be the most gruesome and the most brutal challenge that Katie Harvey will ever have to go through throughout her their entire career. That's a big statement, but it's also a realistic one. Just look at our female and the way she's posed right now. And this is for too. too. Our female is dangerous alone. But when you put a championship up for grasp behind a long tournament, that beast is as hungry as ever. And her claws are as sharp and as dangerous as ever too. The following match is the final of the Women's Wrestling Revolution Tournament. The challenger to my left is from Berlin, Germany. She weighs 209 pounds. Here is Alpha Female. And her opponent in the corner to my right. She is from Bray, Ireland. She is weighing 156 pounds. Here is the Queen of Well, this is a fitting end to the tournament. We're about to see the Queen of Wrestling go toe to toe against the Beast and the other female. Will she be able to take down the monster? And will she be able to leave here with the crown that she's desired for far too long? We're on their way to the finals of the Women's Wrestling Revolution Tournament. Katie Harvey versus Alpha Female. And already, I think Katie has made one huge mistake and is trying to tangle with Female. Surprise though, Alpha Female being a bit cautious now. Not trying to use her power on their way. They try to reserve all her strength for one or two massive blows to finish the deal as quick as possible. And a tie in. And again. Again, not, not smart on the part of Katie. This is the obvious result. I don't know if she's trying to size her up, but I think at this point there is nothing to do. We all know the straight advantage goes to Alpha Female. No need for experiments right now. Katie, you need to... No, not again! And just like that now, Alpha Female is actually a bit more vicious and she's getting tired of it. She doesn't need to prove anything to Katie. I need to point out once again that vicious hold and that vicious combination of going with the fight and then... Wait, 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 what? Wait, what? Did I see our female getting pushed back a bit? Oh, she's done it now. Ah, oh, boom. And just like that, our female going at it. Gonna snap me right now. And after that, I think she's gonna go into that vice. Following it up with those discus combinations, and that's the end of that. Kick out a two of the chin lock. 
but that's the game plan of other female, just wear and tear the opponent, and after that, just hook in that fight, and if, if K survives, if that's a huge if, then just finish her up with those discus combos, and that's it, that's it. But in the meantime, before we get into that, before, before heck, it would even happen, she might actually gain the victory from this hold. And now the female, again, not Link Harvey, break out of this hole. Just wrenching in the neck and the arms of Harvey and the queen of wrestling right now is to pull one out of the back and there she goes. Harvey though, still feeling the effects of that submission hole. Another female. But a wear and tear with a suplex. Pitting down Harvey. Harvey's two, and she does, she's out. I gotta give Harvey all the credit in the world. She survived one hell of a beating, not just in this match, but also the other matches that she's been through, especially the one against Wesna. This has been a dominant line for our female, and she's displaying again, once again, her dominance against the Queen of Wrestling. And now she's got her today. High driver into a gut wrench. Hold on, but the Queen reverses. Drop kick into the corner, and Alpha Female is dazed. Uppercut City time. Rebound from the corner, and another one. Irish whip into the oil. Oh, oh, spoke too soon. And Alpha Female reverses it, and I reverse it right there by Harvey. Finally following it up with the second uppercut. Her knees now, okay, little female, needs to grasp herself, and just like that, just like that, and she tosses Harvey from the top into the middle of the ring. And here we go with those vicious mountain punches, and we all know what comes after this one. Here we go, she's going for the vice, and she sinks it in. Katie right now is probably the most damaged person to ever been trapped this hole throughout this entire night. Even though she would escape, she's gonna feed it. And she's gonna feed it big time. And after that, we all know what comes up next. Those discus shots, and it's game over. And that's it, she doesn't tap out. But she did it, she grabbed the ropes. But feed in. Press begin those last few moments, last few seconds in to damage the opponent just a little bit more. Surprise there. Katie fighting back usually. They just fall back with no energy and let a female hit those discus shots. Alpha though now. Just raking the face and the eyes of Harpy on that top rope. Once again, Ricky the eyes. Harvey right now, I think the chances just keep on getting slimmer and slimmer for Harvey to walk out of here with the crown jewel. And here we go with the shots. When she blocked it. Into a neck lock and a takedown. I know she's got an Achilles team lock. Trapped between those massive biceps of Alpha Female. Oh, but that's quick ring awareness right there on the part of the Queen of Wrestling. Forcing our female to break that vicious video team hole. And now going back to working on Katie. And now she's got her in the gut wrench. Dominator! And the new Queen has been crowned! What? Harvey! The Queen of Wrestling still has heart. Oh no, but the female going right back to work. Hold on, she's got him with the roll up. Oh no, 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 no. Oh hell no, Alpha female going with the coastline as she kicks out of that surprise roll. Damn. Connecting death, me talk of a coastline. Two. Only a two count, okay. 
this they can believe that Harvey managed to get I don't know if it's Tommy but that close like will get up I still can't believe that Harvey not only dead is fighting back with all her heart and with all her adrenaline one more she says and she does three times the charm and a spear the gamble doesn't pay off and Alpha female right now. And I, I, I'm not surprised. We need the effect of the onslaught behind those shots. Behind the tenacity of Katie Harvey. Referee at six now. At seven. And now both these women getting up at the same time. Or I should say, Alpha female picking up Harvey. Another shot! No! You've got to be kidding me! Those knockout blows have taken out everyone! But Harvey... Harvey's the exception right now! And Harvey kicking out, and not only dead, kicking in the back of the head of another female! She ducks it in! Roll up! What? Harvey's done it! Harvey has become the queen of this division! Harvey has won the crown jewel and is the ruler of this women's wrestling division. She has conquered this tournament and thus far has conquered the division. And now I can say with utmost clarity that Katie Harvey is now the utmost solidified queen of GWF. Upset, I tell you. Congratulations to Barbie. She deserves it. She went through hell of a war. Not just with other people, but with everybody, with every opponent she had.